Hello and welcome to my channel. This is Joy from She Speaks Too. Make sure you like, make sure you comment, and make sure you subscribe. In today's video, we are going to go to the property. You guys have not had an update in a long time. So um, the parapet part is done. And then we also made some new shocking updates to the um, property just for Sienna. We're calling it Sienna Grace Land, like Grace Land, like Elvis because Grace is her middle name. So I'm going to take you to the property so you can see the upgrades and see if you want to visit, you can come, but there will be a service charge just like if you were going to Disney World. So here we are headed to the property. And one thing we tell everyone that visits us, you have to have a four wheel drive in order to navigate. We pull up on the house, there's the parapet design um, and then there's a little surprise back there. We put in a playground for Sienna and trampoline. Um, there is a little closer view of the parapet, but we're also going to do the um, drone video so you guys will see that. This little landing strip is actually for her to ride her roller skates. We wanted to have a place where she could have as much fun as possible. Then as you can see, it leads up to the playground. And so this is what um, we have for her and her friends. We have a little climbing place like mountain climbing here. Then um, we have um, just standard playground, but in Liberia, it means so much. And then we have her trampoline. So of course there is our river view. And then this little jewel, uh, my husband put in a bathroom because we have been inviting friends and entertaining quite a bit. And so if you invite people, they need to be able to use a bathroom. So he installed or put in a bathroom that has running water. Um, from the looks of it, it doesn't look like much, but it's actually so valuable to have a bathroom out in the bush. Okay, with running water, sink and camu. So here's the bathroom, you open the door and it's not anything fancy, but it's clean and it's functional. We have a sink, we have a toilet, we have our soap, tissue, napkins, anything you can think of. And this is our little skateboarding <laughs> ring for Sienna. So this device here is called a Blue Eddy and this is very valuable. We keep this in our bedroom actually. It runs on charge and a charge can last for a very, very long time. Um, so to the right, you see all those outlets that you can plug things in to use. Um, a lot of our appliances can be used on that. When LEC goes and we don't want to put the generator on, we have a fan, a couple of fans plugged in there. Um, and so you can do a plethora of things on this. Um, it's a, like a portable mini generator that's safe for indoor use also. So here I'm going to be um, barbecuing because I'm the chef of the day. So I have right next to it is our um, air fryer. So I'm going to be barbecuing for our guests. I'm going to be doing like hot dogs for the kids and doing some chicken for the adults. Okay, so like I said, that's the Blue Eddy device there. The portable generator safe for indoor because it doesn't run on fuels, fumes or anything that could be harmful. And then this is our... Um, air fryer so right now i am grilling some hot dogs for the girls for the kids basically so that's what's going on there and then like i said i'm the chef chefess with the mostest i'm making um i'm grilling some chicken because we're gonna have uh grilled chicken and dry rice so that was the meal and then of course some drinks for the for everyone all right, so just another view. Blue Eddie is the name. If anyone has any questions, just put it in the um, put it in the um, comment section. And then this was the chicken. See, just like you would barbecue, was delicious and good. Then the chef has to take a break. She's tired. So now we have um, the drone footage of everything. Here's how the playground looks. Here is how the house looks from above. There's the children running. <laughs> I don't know where they were. I think they were running to go wash their hands. I think that was when the um, barbecue was done. So here's a closer look at the house and of course the parapet design that we did. 
And if you want to know more about that, that's in my last home um, building video. Um, there's another view. This is actually the front of the house here. And I think we'll get a little closer, hopefully. So yeah, here's a little closer view of the top with a parapet design. So this home building process is not for cheering, is not for the faint of heart. You just gotta hang in there and do the best that you can. Um, it will all pay off in the end, although it's taxing and can be frustrating at times. Okay, so here's just a still picture of the, the, the skateboarding, not skateboarding, roller skate um, rink that we did for Sienna. And then of course, just this is the back of the house um, facing the river. So here is the playground um, for her, Graceland, Sienna Graceland so she can have some fun and invite her friends. Um, the only thing is that we just want them to open up the roads. The roads are still bad to the property, so we're just praying that some big shop moving our neighborhood and just finish the rule for us. We're not doing the best that we can, but we need help. Lord, we need help. And we also put a trampoline there so she can just have fun by the river with her friends. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I hope you comment. I hope you like. I hope you subscribe. This is Joy from She Speaks Too. Make sure you like, make sure you comment, and make sure you subscribe. And I will see you later.